WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento setting in for Tom O'Brien, and boy, oh boy, what a day to set in for the master himself. Holy cow, it's amazing, folks. We had the Dow down 300 points at one time, but the problem is the market came back and rallied to get up on the day 300 points in the Dow Jones, and now it's down 50 points. So we've had a 700-point swing in the Dow Jones Industrial Average. NASDAQ was crazy, too. It's up 200 and some points. The s and still up 25, but the, the Dow Jones, which is the one that's in the newspaper all the time because it's uh, some of the more popular stocks, even though they are price-weighted, they're not cap-weighted. And uh, so that's the main thing you want to keep in mind here. Now, we had a big move in Treasury bonds to the upside as interest rates started to drop, even though the Federal Reserve added uh, interest rates today by adding a quarter percent uh, to the discount rate. And, of course, I don't know what the esteemed chairman of the Fed did, uh, Mr. Uh, Jerome Powell, but uh, he's done something to stabilize the markets because they were down sharply. Uh, then when he started to speak, the market reversed. So whatever he said was taken by investors that, yep, this meets, meets a good uh, specifications for a market to go higher, and by golly, it took off, and that's exactly where it went. So just remember, folks, these guys, I don't know where they come up with this stuff or not, and that's one of the reasons why I'm a technician. I don't have to listen to what they have to say. I want to react to what they have to say, but what they have to say doesn't mean anything to me because that's just one man's opinion. And the opinion that we really care about is that opinion at the stock exchange where there's more buyers or more sellers or more sellers and more buyers. That's what we have to go by. If prices are going up, you've got more buyers. If prices are going down, you've got more sellers. And right now, prices have been reacting to the downside, and uh, there's more selling to the downside. We've still got the S&Ps up, almost 40 handles. Uh, but the others, the Dow Jones is down 30, S&P, up, uh, NASDAQ up 240, Treasury bonds up well more, a point and a half, and uh, the dollar is getting hit pretty hard. The euro is up, the pound is up, the yen is up, the Canadian is up, and also the, uh, the Australian dollar is up. So all of the currencies are going up. So we'll see you on the flip side tomorrow. Live every day in an attitude of gratitude, and may God bless. 